Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 14 of season 2 of The Bad Batch. We've got this and two more episodes left after this. I'm really nervous, really scared. I don't know where we're going to go. The um, thumbnail for this episode is scaring me. Um, I don't usually look at the, the thumbnails. Like I usually just kind of go on to click the previous episode and then like sort of like scroll to the next one. So I don't see any thumbnails or any names or anything. But um, I accidentally did it wrong this time. Um, I accidentally scrolled too far and now I can see the thumbnail. So I am scared because I don't know what's going to happen to Crosshair. I hope he's safe. I hope he's okay. Um, so yeah, let's just... Let's get into the episode. <laughs> I have so much anxiety already. Last week was so wholesome and sweet for the most part. Hauser? He's back! He's back! Yo! Prisoners for transport. <laughs> also, I now know Scorch properly. I recently played Republic Commando uh, on stream. The VODs are on my second YouTube channel, which is linked somewhere on my channel. But I now know Scorch as well, so this is like super exciting. Oh my god, Hauser. Oh my god, bruh. Rex and Echo have done such a great job. Look at them go. I have so many goosebumps. You're getting saved, boys. Fireball. Good to see you, ah! I guess we'll have to get that intel out of Oh, he is shaking in his boots. Okay, they need to stop doing that. That's like three or four times we've seen that now in multiple shows. Stop! He sounds very like Gregor. Yeah, that's not good. Lads. Lads, please. Make it out. It is Gregor! <laughs> it is Gregor! <laughs> My baby boy! <laughs> it's Gregor! <laughs> There's no way we've got Echo, Gregor, and Hauser all together! <laughs> Nobody has a voice like Gregor. I was like, I they haven't said his name yet, but I don't want to say it's Gregor, but it sounds like Gregor. <laughs> oh, crosshair, please. They're coming to see if you promise. Oh god. We're getting the boys back together. My heart is racing so fast right now. I wonder if they have Cody in here. Ugh. Him. Here quickly, considering the state you arrived in, because I intend to give you a clean slate. No. And all you have to do in exchange is tell me how to find Clone Force Ninety Nine. Oh. The kid. He knows. Very good. He's like, but <laughs> I'm not telling you where Omega is. His voice. I don't know where they are. I mean, turret two. He doesn't. He genuinely doesn't know where they are. That's the thing. He doesn't know where Pabu is. <laughs> don't hurt him. No. 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 Doctor. One of our transport ships was attacked departing Balmora. 
But yeah, his voice is so like slow and deep. It's very Thrawn, where he doesn't have to speak loud or oh, Coruscant. They don't have to speak loud or fast. They just speak slowly and calmly, and it's the most intimidating thing. Oh my goodness, how many clones are we gonna have here? Oh, I'm I'm like. <laughs> I'm so glad you're alive, Hauser. So happy. We must find out where that ship was headed. I recovered a portion of the data logs. It's heavily encrypted, but I know someone who can crack it. Be careful, Echo. Please, Echo, please be careful. Oh. Oh, don't show him in pain. He doesn't know where they are. Nobody knows where they are. Crosshair. Take a breath. Think this through. Them. Release me. Don't make this worse, Crosshair. There is no escape. She called him by his name. Lower. Oh. It's nice to hear someone actually, you know, she may be an asshole doing this to him, but she actually respected his name. Moistroid, Moistroid, Moisty, Moisty, Moisty. Oh, he took the stun off. Oh, crosshair. I hope this doesn't end badly for him. Please release the other clones. Nothing can stop him. Oh, this music is epic. I'm so, like, tensed up right now. My muscles are stressed. My heart is stressed. <gasps> is he gonna send a signal? Yay! An unauthorized outgoing transmission is being sent from Terminal 3. You have to hide. They're after hope. trouble processing the toxin it's my own special formula one i've built an immunity to oh you asshole you however have not, have not. oh my god this episode keeps going from happy to sad to happy to sad and now back to wholesome and happy but they're gonna receive the signal tech is gonna receive that signal look at him fishing their happy stay isn't going to be much lasting much longer. But it's nice that they're helping rebuild, though. I find it funny that Wrecker's fishing. That's that's great. He's not helping carry boxes. He's just fishing. This friend of yours who's stopping by. If you trust him. Oh. <laughs> fishing docks rebuilt. <laughs> and I caught some dinner. <laughs> that's why he's doing it. You've been busy. You got that right. <laughs> oh, he's so happy to be helping. He's in his element. Integral part of this community. You all have more flying lessons. Uh huh. Tex got his hands full. Oh, is he teaching her to fly? <laughs> oh my God, he looks terrified. <laughs> Copy that. He's like, why did I sign up for this? Who signed me up for this? <laughs> oh. getting better, right? The collision alarms haven't gone off. I love their the bonding. Out during your last lesson, Real Festival. The tech turn? Really? Now that is not what it is. <laughs> the tech turn. But I rather like it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love him. <laughs> Oh, she's wonderful. She did so good. Much better. It's him. Echo's gonna be so proud. This is him at five. Do you copy? Affirmative, having fun. I see you've been keeping up with your training. <laughs> good. Race you to the landing zone. 
I do not think that is a sound idea. You're on. <laughs> oh, Echo, you're such a bad influence. <laughs> Hi, baby boy. I'm gonna cry at them reuniting, aren't I? Oh. You ain't kidding. It hasn't been that long. Feels like it has. What about you? What have you been up to? <laughs> well... Max and I have built up a small network of clones. Some are in hiding, underground. Hunter, I decrypted the data. You need to get back to the ship. Uh-oh. The Imperial Transport Echo Hijack was assigned to the Advanced Science Division. Never heard of it. Dr. Royce Hamlock, an officer expelled from the Republic Science Corps due to his unauthorized and unorthodox experiments. Makes sense. Why were they sending clone prisoners to him? Previous transfer records recovered from the ship's logs list other clone prisoners detained by the Advanced Science Division. And Crosshair is one of them. You mean Crosshair turned on the Empire? How sure are you about this? I checked our old comm channels and found a recent distress message sent from Crosshair's old code. What did it say? We are being targeted. I believe he is warning us. He or did the best trap. he could. Like he said for us no, it's not a trap. I get why you're worried, but I promise it's not a trap. Well, how do we find out? All I need is the young clone. She means nothing to you. I feel like she's gonna help him. I don't know, something... Something's giving me the vibes. Let's see how long. Maybe not, I don't know. I just want to believe someone's gonna help him. But there's not really much she can do at this point. Wipe that dirty smile off your face. Not her, him. Dear Filoni, what are you doing to us? Why would you put us through this pain? Do you like seeing us suffer? Okay, so our only named clones there were Fireball, Gregor, Hauser, and Nemec. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That's very exciting. Guys, 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 guys. Okay, okay, okay. Gregor, we have Gregor. Gregor, Gregor's here, guys. Gregor. So for those who don't know, Gregor is my second favorite clone of all time. After Fives at number one. Um, oh, I'm so happy. It's like, I, I, I never want to be like, oh, is that such and such clone? Because I know when you say the wrong thing in Star Wars, people will be like, oh my God, you're such a fake Star Wars fan. Clones all look the same, okay? So uh, as soon as I heard his voice, I was like, Gregor? But I didn't say it. I wanted confirmation before I said it. And then I heard his voice again. I was like, no, that has to be Gregor. It has to be. And it was. It was great. It was <laughs> I'm so happy. You have no idea. Like, I keep saying, like, oh, I really hope the Rex goes and finds Wolf and Gregor and Cody. And he got Gregor. And he got Hauser. They got Hauser back, guys. We got Hauser back. We got Hauser. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. I'm, like, I'm like in, like, a, a hyperactive, hyperfixated, non-functioning excitable state right now i don't know how else to describe it i am just stunned that episode was like so much in one so much happened um crosshair baby boy someone please help him please go help him tech and the rest of the crew's face when they realized the crosshair was there i mean tech especially looked really worried hunter obviously has suspicions that's fair but like please help him please help him please 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 he's not gonna send out a signal to you guys as a trap he's not gonna do that um I'm really worried for him, but I do feel like there's something going on with the with the the lady. I'm feeling slight vibes that she might try and help him. I don't know. I would like to believe. I'd like to hope that she will try her best. I don't know why. Something about her just feels. I don't know. There's just something about her. I don't know how to describe it, but I, I I'd like to hope so. At least she'll try and help him. I guess with how like determined he was, I'm not really sure. Um. But motherfucking Dr. Royce, whatever he's called. Oh, he's terrifying. I do not like him. He gives me the heebie-jeebies. 
He gives me shivers down my spine. He makes me feel so uncomfortable. He makes my skin crawl the way he the way he talks. That that he has done it so well. That character has been presented so well. It's done what it's meant to do. Make you scared and intimidated. Um so uh the next I feel like the next three episodes are going to be very 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 intense. Um but we're still, you know, we didn't get to see Rex this episode. So Rex is probably off, you know, Echo was doing one job. Rex was probably off doing another job, maybe Cody, maybe Wolf, I'm not too sure. I feel like Rex will come back with Cody and Wolf. I feel like that's going to be how it is. Um, but knowing that, like, Echo helped Hauser and, you know, they helped Gregor and stuff, that makes me so happy. Um, but we're going to have, I feel like, I wonder if, like, we're just going to get, like, all the clones to just storm this facility and then free the rest of the clones and then take them all back and live on Pabu and everything will be fine, right? Yeah? I don't know. Well, I'm 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 glad that they that the the clones have found them rather than them finding the clones because that means that we can chase them and it means that they're not going to chase them. They're not going to chase the clones and they're not going to go to Pabu and they're not going to ruin that really nice place because I feel like they've already had enough destruction and heartbreak uh, in the last episode. So it's nice that the empire isn't on their way to Pabu, at least not that we know yet. Um but it's nice to know that, you know, we're going to them and they're not coming to us kind of thing. So that's good. Um, I am stressed. I am nervous. I'm excited. That was such a good episode. This week, or this, today has been so good for Mandalorian and Bad Batch content. Like, I'm I'm in the greatest mood right now, but also scared. I'm like, so many moods that I can't really describe. Um, but yeah, also, I wanted to show you guys. So I recently made an order from one of my friends on Twitter and Instagram, uh, Elaine Creations. Um, I placed an order from her Etsy, a bunch of Jedi Fallen Order stuff, but two things I want to show you that I got. So I got this. It's my Fives Emotional Support Himbo sticker. I think it is top tier. Um, and she gave me a free one off Jesse. So I've got Jesse on my phone because he's tiny. You can see my little Fives uh, pop socket. Uh, my little Emotional Support Jesse Himbo um and my fives one so those are very exciting i i love i love these a lot um i'm hoping to find like a lot more merch at celebration and stuff i'm gonna buy so much clone merch it's unbelievable um but yeah i just wanted to show you guys that because i think it's really cool so make sure you go check out her twitter and instagram and etsy and stuff um it's like linked in my twitter so you can find it there but yeah anyway guys thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as i did hope you enjoy my reaction to realizing that it's gregor um and yeah i'll see you guys next week so next week um i um so for the next week from tomorrow i will be in england um and i get back on wednesday i get r back around halfway through the day so my mandalorian and bad batch videos will be lit uh, I don't think they'll be the next day. I mean, I think maybe one of them might be the next day. Like, it depends how long it takes to get home and how long it takes to record and edit. But I'm going to try my best to get them up as quickly as possible. So don't be expecting them ASAP. Because I will be away. Because I'm going to Megacon this weekend. Um, and I've got a couple of other things I'm doing this weekend and stuff as well. So I'll be back mid... Sort of mid-afternoon, I would say, on Wednesday. And then I'll get into recording as soon as possible. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys next week. <laughs> Can't wait to stress for the next week waiting for these episodes. Um, but, yeah. May the Force be with you.